Hi all, welcome to my channel. So today's recipe is of Varai Ka Opma Bhagar, also called as Banyard Millet. It's a very healthy millet, usually made during fasting, but you can make it otherwise as well. Okay, so here is the rice I'm going to be cooking. Now, uh, in India, it has a lot of names. It's called uh, Sama Ke Chawal, it's called uh, Bhagar. In Marathi, it's called Vari Che Tandur. Uh, Banyard Millet in English, it's kind of a... Uh, thicker version of uh, suji and it's really healthy not only during fasting you can in general also have this it's uh, very healthy and filling as well so let's see how to prepare it okay so let's heat up the gas first and to this we'll be adding around two spoons of ghee Now once the ghee is hot, we'll add in we'll add a teaspoon of cumin, let it splatter a little bit. This goes in green chilies. Now this depends on how much spicy you want. And some curry leaves. Once your chili and curry leaves have been roasted, we'll add in the rice, the samake rice. Uh, I've taken around half a cup, uh, which is enough for one to two persons. You can increase the quantity according to how many people you're making for. And we'll just roast it a little bit. Now for the liquid part here, I'm taking some curd. Now this is what my Aji did. I'm not sure if everyone uses curd, but it really tastes nice with some curd in it. So I'm taking around uh, four spoons of curd. So to half a cup of uh, the rice, I'm gonna use um, one and a half cups of water. So in four spoons of curd, I'll add water and give it a mix and we'll add this to the rice now my rice has been roasting for around 30 seconds to a minute to this we are going to add in a peanut powder this gives a really nice flavor i'm adding around four spoons of it you can add according to your taste give it a mix add in the curd mixture which we have kept ready and around half a cup of more water Add salt according to taste, the Sendha Namak which we use. And a little bit of jaggery. Now uh, people add sugar, I'm adding um, jaggery. You can add whichever you like. Around half a teaspoon of it. Give it a mix. And now cover this and cook it till the rice is done or the water is absorbed it will take around two to three minutes on medium flame give it a stir in between and let it cook Now here you can see all the water has evaporated. We'll just uh, cook it open for around 30 seconds till it becomes a little dry. Okay, so here our rice is done and I'm gonna serve it. Here our upma is ready. 
I just garnish it with a little bit of uh, coconut. This is optional, but it gives a very nice flavor. And just a curry leaf. And your aupma is ready. So hope you enjoyed the recipe. If so, do like, share, comment and subscribe. I will see you with another video. Till then, bye, take care and stay safe.